This is Philip Tudor of the Anderson Star. And as you can see, we're standing in what used to be the old Glen Addy Hose Company here in West Anniston. Here on the floor at the Glen Addy Hose Company, where they kept the horses, two of the horses' names are still inscribed in the concrete floor here. As you can see right here, this is where Lewis was. Whenever they would put the saddles on Lewis and hook him up to the, to the trailer to pull the uh, fire equipment, this is his side. Over here to my left, that's where the horse named Todd, that's where he would be saddled up. He's over there to my left. The building's been vacant for 20 or 30 years. But the cool thing about this building is it's on the National Historic Register list. It was built in 1885. It was the first permanent firehouse structure in the city of Anniston back when, they, when Mr. Noble and Mr. Tyler came here and built their city. This was the first one. The fire, the fire department stayed here until 1917. After 1917, they moved what now is firehouse number two over to F Street. This building became a bunch of other things in the last hundred years. It's been a church. You can still see, see the sign above me that's there. Salvation Army had their thrift store here. There was a funeral supply company here, lots of different things. In the mid 70s, the, there were classified ads in the store that advertised this place as a house for rent with four bedrooms in it, even though there are no, there's no uh, sign of any bedrooms being remaining in it today.